Hello. <laughs> My name is Logan Austin. Um, I'm currently a student at UNT. I'm studying um, composition, jazz. Um, my interests are kind of all over the place. Um, I'm originally from Austin, Texas. I'm currently 20 years old. I think what makes my work unique is just the every. It's just that it's the it's the combination of everything that like I enjoy. It's a combination of all of my tastes, and I think my tastes are pretty diverse. I'm into I'm into jazz music, classical music, film scores, rap. Um, a weird electronic music that you listen to and then probably not even think is actual music. Like it's just a lot of different things that I really enjoy and I think the stuff that I make is just kind of a big conglomeration of, of all of those different tastes into one thing is, which is, and that is what makes I think my music, my music more unique and makes it like my own. How would you describe your relationship with music? On one level it's intimate. I can listen to it alone in my room and, and feel like a thousand different emotions if I want to, depending on the song or whatever I'm into at the time or what I'm feeling at the time. But then on the other hand, what makes it super relatable is that you can listen to a piece of music and like have so many other people listen to it and like it and appreciate it on like completely different levels. So many people can get so many different things out of it. You can have, you know, a bunch of people listening to and liking the same music, like like going to concerts, going to any kind of like big cultural event like music is such a big part of culture and I think it's one of the things that like like unites a lot of people it can be both super intimate and personal to you and it can also be like a binding thing for you to, to um, feel connected to your community how do you start a project what's your creative process like whenever um, I first started making music I thought that there was some kind of set creative process that I just didn't know but the, th the thing that I've learned recently as I've composed more and more is that there's really not and you can kind of just do whatever <laughs> you want. Basically what that means is that my creative process ends up being just kind of, it just depends on whatever I'm doing. Sometimes I'll, I'll, I'll be messing around on a piano, I'll come up with a cool melody, I'm like, oh that's a really neat melody. I'll, maybe I'll put it with these chords and maybe I'll change the rhythm up this way. Or like maybe I'll just come up with like an idea, like a feeling. So my creative process is basically just whatever Whatever just happens, I just kind of let things happen, and that's that's how I make stuff. Whenever I think about the definition of music, the one of the big things that I think about is, um, I mean, anything you want to be music kind of just can be music. You can listen to the birds singing outside your window, and like you might not think it's music because it's like, oh, this doesn't have a set pitch or harmony or whatever you want to call it, but it can be music if you want it to be. I, I feel like music can basically just be whatever you want to define as music. It can be something. It can be like easily manageable, like pop music, everyone likes pop music, or it can be something weird, it can be the sound of a trash can falling over <laughs> if you want it to be, it can just be whatever you want. The thing about me is I've always been, I've always gravitated towards uh, music that goes with something. I've always loved um, film music, TV music, media music. One of the very first things I remember learning when I was like like five years old or something at my little piano in my house was like learning just the Star Wars theme on the piano just because I really like Star Wars and I thought the music was really cool. I, I just think it's super cool being able to play music that goes along with something that, that sort of frames a bigger story. So, media music is something that I really want to go into. I think the world needs music because I think art in general is just very important to us, especially like now. I don't know, it feels like so much more and more stuff is getting more artificial and like automated nowadays and like very corporate. Everything feels gray and bleak. I think individuality is something that really needs to be to be expressed. And there needs to be more things that are like very clearly passion projects and not just like entertainment cranked out to, to earn money and, and put people in seats to watch movies or things like that. I think there's a lot of value in, in, in art that's very obviously like a passion project or very obviously like an individual's um, unfiltered vision. I, I feel like stuff like that is super important so we don't like lose um, that part of like humanity I suppose. <laughs>